back in LA, well, Anaheim, checking out the hotel last night. I went to uh, Disney. It was fun. Haven't been there for a few years. Uh, and uh, yeah, my flight's not till later, so I'm gonna see what I could do around this area. Last time I was in LA, I missed my flight. So this time, I gotta make sure I give myself enough time to get back to the airport. I had to stop at Wendy's real quick. I'm gonna meet up with some family near LAX to get some uh, lunch. But LAX is an hour away. And I'm starving. So. So I went down to uh, Hollywood Walk of Fame. It was a lot different than I what, thought it was because uh, when I was a kid, it looked all huge. <laughs> but it was uh, kind of short and uh, not too exciting. So here down to Universal's City Walk and check out what's here. to go to City Walk, but I ended up just coming to Universal Studios and checking it out. I haven't been here in like 20 years, so it's a little bit different. It's so cool. I didn't get on any rides, but I did take the, the studio tour. Totally different, pretty crazy, a little insane. Now, I gotta try to make it back to the airport so I don't miss my flight because I stood here longer than I should have. 
Okay, so instead of taking the train back, which is the way I got here, uh, it wasn't that hard. It's just that I don't want to miss, miss my flight. So I have to go back to the Chinese theater, pick up the car, and then drive to the airport. So we're pushing for time. Hopefully I don't miss my flight. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Okay, so an hour and 43 minutes is a suggested time for me to get back to the airport from Google Maps. And uh, yeah, LA traffic. It's not gonna get me this time. Not gonna get me this time. Time is 4.30. My boarding time is eight o'clock. Says I should be at the airport by 6.15-ish. So. Continue on North Island Avenue for half a mile. 